Hello, as we have already understood what is cardinality of model attributes and how it can be used, now we'll see an use case of it. In this video, we'll see how to multi-select items from a list box. So here we have a list box named choose a car containing car name Jimmy and we'll try to select multiple items here. I have already created a module for this box. Here. Now the next step is to create a generic list item. So right click on this module attribute and select create generic list item. So the item is now created. If you will notice the cardinality of this module attribute item is from 0 to n which means that we can make use of this item multiple times in a single test step. Now let's drag and drop it onto a test strip which I have already created. Okay. Now the next thing is to select the items. So let's select Volvo. Okay. And then Audi. Now generally we select multiple items by pressing the control key on the keyboard and then performing the click operation. To imitate the same thing, we have a keyboard command. Alright, that's it. Now let's run it to see if it selects the multiple values. Hooray, it has selected the multiple values successfully. So that's how you can make use of cardinality and multiple items. I hope you find this video helpful. 